did a thing. As you can see by the fact I have a box sitting in front of me that's almost the size of me. I mean, I'm five foot four, it's not really hard. I decided to take a step and buy something that is gonna help me be creative and make some art. We are going to unbox my new toy together. This is the first time I've ever had a chance to do an unboxing and that's extremely exciting so I'm hopping on the train. We are gonna unbox my new Cricut. Okay, let's just jump in to this huge thing. <laughs> Oh my god! I feel I'm gonna take this out of the box the wrong way and that's gonna be really bad for YouTube. It's so big. No, it's not right. It's, it's right. If you're wondering, yes, I did match my top. I can't open things. This is a very chaotic unboxing. I'm so excited. It feels like Christmas. Oh. Um. I have another one of these in my box. Yeah, I, I ordered one of those. It didn't say it came in the box. Okay, so we have some starter stuff. But we'll read that once we get the actual thing right itself. Oh, got it. Look at her. She's so beautiful. Okay, it's still in its packaging because I'm a little bit afraid to remove it. Like, it just looks so beautiful. I don't want to get my grubby fingers on it. But here is everything that came with my Cricut. So obviously, we have the beautiful machine herself. Like, stunning. We are matching. It's beautiful. <laughs> the boring type of stuff, like the power supplies, which I'm going to plug in in a second. All the starter kits, which I still haven't read, but we're not to the setting up part yet, so we'll get there. A light grip cutting mat, which I wasn't aware that they came with, so I ordered another one. Which I suppose, I suppose a spare will never go amiss, will it? And then a pen. I ordered the scraper and the spatula in a special bundle from Hobbycraft, so I don't think this comes with every Cricut, but it did come with mine. And it's so cute, so let's get to the fun bit of getting it set up and actually working. Okay, before we can start printing anything exciting on this little baby, we have to calibrate it and get it set up. We are gonna go on to cricket.com slash set up. I got too excited the other day and already made a cricket ID, so this saves me some time now. It's so sticky.
Okay, so as you all saw, I took a little break from Cricut crafting for a little minute. Oh, hello. <laughs> I minded the dogs who are trying to get up to the camera right now and played some Animal Crossing, which is kind of embarrassing. I haven't played in a while and I feel I just got absolutely roosted by every villager, but that's part of playing Animal Crossing, right? Right? But yeah, I just felt really... Hello, were you trying to get in the camera? <laughs> I just felt super inspired after playing to create some doodles. I can maybe try and print out a stickers and see how formatting Procreate files works on my Cricut. I'm gonna draw some of my favorite Animal Crossing villagers. I'm currently working on a little doodle of Poppy. She's so sweet, she's so pure, she's just my favorite. And we'll see, we'll see if I draw any more or we'll just try with an assorted mishmash of doodles that I have, but I'm really excited to keep working on the Cricut and actually do some stickers. I've only done the little mountain that you saw, which is like a pre-installed Cricut test thing. But it was really fun and I'm so excited and I can't believe I have it already. So let's do some drawing and then get back to the Cricut. I've kind of been a little bit MIA in terms of the vlog. It's quite a few hours later from whenever I last vlogged setting up my Cricut and all that fun stuff. I did some doodles which I'm really excited about to turn into stickers. Like it actually feels kind of crazy that I can have a sticker of something I've done. Rather than like buying a sticker of someone else's like actual proper art. It'll be mine which is, it's blowing my mind like a lot. As you saw there was some failed attempts uh, making my little anxious stickers which I mean like it's just adding to the anxiety really by the failure yes I I gave up for a little bit I took a little break I'd been looking at my screens all day between uni and drawing and setting up the cricket I'm gonna do a little spot of reading head to bed and I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow I was anticipating it just to be like a one day kind of art vlog but I'm gonna make some successful stickers of the cricket whether it kills me so I'll see you tomorrow we're gonna get this sorted and be successful and I can't wait to show you the stickers I make. This is what happens when I try to vlog. Okay, take two. Good morning and happy Friday. I'm back vlogging for another day because I'm determined we're gonna get some successful stickers. No miss cuts this time. I'm gonna figure out how to work the design space and where these things are appropriate. And it's gonna be great. I'm really excited, but yes. We have another like yellow theme going on today. I mean like, come on, yellow tapestry, yellow books, yellow crank kid. I mean, if you've watched any of my other vlogs, you'll know just how much I love yellow, but I do, which is why we have a yellow cricket sitting on my desk, which, oh man, I've had it for one day and I just love it so much. I'm so excited for everything I can create. It's so nice. And I'm so excited to be making a YouTube video on this because I've watched a million vlogs whenever people buy crickets and make stickers on it. Like it's my ASMR and just like watching that machine cut out the stickers. It's just amazing. So I'm creating my own. Cricket ASMR. I will try whenever we get some successful stickers to get the ASMR clips in this video in case you like them just as much as I do. But yeah, go do some creating. I, I've had a really chill morning. It's about lunchtime now. I've just watched the newest episode of WandaVision. So yeah, now the highlight of my week, which is WandaVision, is done. I guess the stickers will have to be the highlight for the rest of today.
we have a successful printed round of stickers. I'm just looking at them and honestly I'm just like these are all my babies like we did this. I'm, I'm really proud, I'm really happy and here is the reveal. We're gonna get one. Oh they're so good, they're so much better than the off-center ones from last night. The reason I'm buying the sticker is I sat yesterday, I was trying to film the unboxing of my Cricut and everything else throughout the day and I've taken a little break from YouTube I have a lot on my plate with uni last week and last week a vlog or a video was just not happening so quick little break back to it this week but I was so irrationally anxious about getting in front of the camera and vlogging so here we go now you all know my anxiety and we're all in this together I'm virtually sending you a hello I'm anxious sticker in case anybody else needs it too sometimes just getting in front of camera is a little bit daunting but I have had an absolute blast working out my cricket and vlogging and filming for all of you guys it's a little bit different from my usual content it's my first kind of art or studio vlog which I don't know if you can even call it a studio vlog considering I'm recording this in my bedroom but we're gonna call it one anyway I'm so happy I love my Cricut and I can't wait to create more with it and create more videos with it too so like it's a double whammy of creation thanks for coming along with me on my journey to make stickers hopefully I'm gonna make more soon and I think I'll vlog the process some sticker sheets some some iron-on vinyl to go on bags and t-shirts and it's just very exciting what I'm gonna be able to do with this Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.